everyone welcome back to another canva tutorial in this video what we are simply going to do is to be creating a sunday service you know poster inside of canva and with this you can use it to announce your services or if there's a special program in your church that's about to happen you can just use this particular design to announce that link that will teach you how to design everything from scratch so make sure you are sticking to the end and without any further ado let's jump straight into canva and let's get started Under the blood. Under the blood. So we can see here is the design and all I'm simply going to do is to come to add a new page okay and we can see what we have over here I just want to start from scratch I'm going to make this a blank canvas white nothing has been added but just in case you're wondering which dimension I'm using I'm simply using the 1080 by 1350 and if you are completely new to Canva this is how to get it make sure you're coming to create design okay and once you come over here if you don't see it as part of the options you can simply come to social media okay and in here you should be able to find it and we can see this is where we have it easy and simple all right so once you click on it you should get not this you should get this okay and yeah let's get started so the background color i'm using is this gray okay and the color code is d9 d8 d3 okay that's the color code i am using all right now come into element in element what you should do is to search for this particular element i'm about to show you okay because i recently used it i just want to pick it out from here all right so geometric geometric pattern okay that's what you have to do so select it and you should have it in here okay then we just increase the size we can see the color we can change the color if you want and that's what i am going to do so i'm going to change the color to black okay then we come to transparency and just reduce the transparency a little bit so that we don't have this you know making so much noise in the back okay all right so now that we are done the next thing we want to do is to add our text so press t on your keyboard to add your text and move it to the top okay and i'll just say sunday service so sunday and you can increase the size okay and since it's all caps once we click on this the upper case okay once you click on it you can see what we have very easy and very simple so sunday then we'll just change the font okay and what i'm going to use is the impact all right so sunday we have it big then we just drop it down a little bit so sunday then duplicate it drop it down and just say service okay so we can see what we have at the moment now select the sunday we can change the color and i'm going to be using this beautiful color and this is the color code ff7d2a all right and we'll just come to the second one then we'll just come back in here to choose this particular one okay this color and that one's also ff8928a all right then let's select everything come into effects okay in effect we'll choose outline all right and automatically it's added this brown outline for me i think it's cool so all i'm just going to do is to reduce the thickness of it okay so something like this is fine so we are done with this text now i'm going to add my image this image okay so if you have a particular image you want to use you can just add it okay so we'll just pop it a little bit and we'll just remove the background and just in case you're on the free version of canva you want to be able to try canva pro for free i have a special link in the description box below that can help you upgrade to canva pro for free so make sure you're checking it out okay yeah very easy and very simple all right so we have our image over here and let's increase the size but we can see the image is going behind the text and that's not something we want to do so i'll just right click come to layer come to bring to front okay and we can see we have it looking nice over here then come to edit in edit come to <clears throat> adjust in adjust we see a lot of options in here we can use to edit our photo so the saturation we are just going to reduce it okay then we'll increase the sharpness and the clarity that's what we are going to do and we can see what we have at the moment now press t on your keyboard to add another text and we'll just keep it here okay then we'll just do worship okay and also make it bigger uh, sorry uppercase and we'll add the bow to it we can increase it a little bit and have it here okay and i'll move this image here a little bit because i want to see 
experience over here and since that one is a bit longer let's see how it's going to look so experience okay so this is what we have at the moment okay all right so let's select the two of them and increase the size more so that at least we are filling in the spaces so i think this looks very very good all right now the next thing we want to do is to add the date and time okay so i'll just duplicate this may okay the 15th may and i'll just select everything and move it to i'll just select everything and align it to the left okay so that's what we have and let's increase the size a little bit then i'll come to effect and just choose the background okay the roundness i'm going to reduce it okay and i think the spread i'm also going to reduce it a little bit so this is what we have at the moment then i can just have it here and maybe you know just have it something like this i think it's cool then we can just duplicate it then we can just duplicate it and have the time also over here with the time it can be let's say 9 am gmt okay so gmt then i think that's also fine and this will be aligned to the right and the color of the background can be changed just to match you know the text colors so we'll just change this and i think this also has to be changed and this can be changed to that okay and the text colors let's change it to white so that they stand out so i think this is very very cool so i'll bring this down here so the next thing we can do is to add the pastor's name you know with you know the pastor's name so i'll duplicate this text instead and i'll just say guest pastor okay guest pastor okay then we will remove the uppercase from there okay and let's correct this and i'll change the font okay so the font is beautiful delicacy or beautifully delicious okay that's the name of the font okay so that's what i'll have over here then we'll duplicate this as well so the guest pastor we can just say maybe jonathan peterson okay so we remove this again and just say jonathan and peterson okay we select everything and we just change the color to that all right okay so i think everything is looking good so far so good now the other thing i would just want us to do is to add maybe the venue and all of that okay and with the venue i'm just going to copy this text and maybe the church name and this okay this extra text we have and i'll just paste it over here okay so this is what we have at the moment and you can see how things are actually looking right now so in this case i can maybe move the venue here and move the church name here and i'll just change the alignment okay so that everything is aligned beautifully and also change the alignment of this as well okay so this is what we have at the moment okay so we just move it in and we want everything to be aligned properly okay so you can see what we have over here and i think this is cute but there's one last thing i want us to do which is you know adding some cloud so you can just go into element okay come to element and search for clouds so once you search for clouds you know you can just add any of them here so i can add one here duplicate it and add another one somewhere here but i'll send it behind the service so i right click come to layer and make sure you're choosing show layers okay good then you move this behind okay so it should be behind the service and this is what we should have and i think this is something very beautiful we have been able to design in canva let me know what you think about it in the comment section below and just in case there's anything you want me to create make sure you're leaving that as well in the comment section below the name is benjamin always remember there is no limit to creativity i should see you in the next video peace